Good morning and welcome to the Spotlight Series, Contemporary Art with Barbara and Shara. Today's visit is to the MoMA Art Hostel, which we will now take you to in just a moment. Hey Shara, what do you think? Shall we do an offering for our Virgin Mary? Yeah, yeah. before we go? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, we are in the area that is called Valle Aurelia and it's actually very known for the Vatican City that is just behind me. We'll first have a peak view uh, looking at the Bernini colonnades. That's the, the main square of, this, uh, of um, the Vatican City where people gather in the, in, on Sunday and see the Pope that is uh, you know, saying hello uh, and doing his mass from uh, the building that you can see in the background. And then also here, the very famous St. Peter's Dome, uh, created by uh, Michelangelo. He designed the dome when he was 71 years old. Obviously, he died in the, you know, during the construction uh, 30 and, and the construction being finished 30 years later. Um, this dome obviously is um, being copied also in the rest of the world, uh, such as the United States Capitol, for example, uh, that is very much inspired by this dome. As we are walking to the MoMA Art Hostel, we actually pass a really important street, which is called the Via delle Fornaci. It's referring to the ovens, the brick ovens that were in this part of the city. Uh, so this area was very known in the Middle Ages and later to help uh, creating the bricks that we, we needed in Rome to build the Vatican City, uh, the, the city of Rome. And then obviously when that industry left the city, uh, this area became a more residential area. Just to have a look at all these beautiful palazzi here in this area. Hello again. Here we are at the MoMA Art Hostel. And before we talk about anything more, I'd like to introduce you to Andrea Bezzikiri, who is the founder and the, uh, the, 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 the motivator behind this very exciting art project. But before we walk inside and before I introduce the MoMA Hostel, I just want everybody to look at the surrounding area, which is so particular. These buildings were built as popular housing buildings in the very uh, early uh, 1900, late 18, early 1900s. And you have this fantastic contrast between the laundry hanging and the works of art at our shoulders, for example, um, the three nails by the very famous Roman artist da uh, Davide Dormino. This is the uh, insignia, the entrance, the logo of MoMA. And of course, we all as Americans think of the MoMA uh, in New York City, but actually it stands for MoMA, Hostel, Meet, Others, meet art, um, which gives the idea, uh, and this is Andrea's uh, real, I think, ingenious uh, initiative, which is that this is a place to stay. It's a hostel for people who pass through Rome and who stay for a short time. It's not a long-term uh, hotel or, or residence, but, um, but it's completely filled with wonderful works of art. And now we're going to walk in and learn more about these with Andrea. Welcome in the MoMA Hostel. MoMA Hostel is a, an hostel, but also a museum of contemporary art and also an hotel. It's a pleasure to welcome everybody inside the, the rooms and inside the museum because here there are more than 300 artworks.
Andrea, thank you so much. This was really a wonderful experience. What a beautiful, beautiful place. And what's remarkable um, is how everything has, uh, in these years has stayed so clean and white and how respectful your clients are for the space and for contemporary art. Yeah, what we discover is that uh, contemporary art make people more responsible. And so yeah. there, there was, uh, and it was incredible, from any part of the world and any type of people to the artworks that are inside. So everything remained in three years untouched. Mm. I was also wondering, um, do you have other plans with uh, the, the space on the wall that is still available or even expanding the concept of MoMA elsewhere? The MoMA hostel is a, a, mu a museum, habitable museum. Mm -hmm. So it's a format. Mm -hmm. And this format we want to replicate in different uh, capital in the world. Mm -hmm. Now we are working on a new project in uh, Venice, for example. Mm -hmm. But I would like also in New York to organize mm -hmm. something. Yeah. We will see. <laughs> we will see. Thank you so, so much. Really? Thank you so it was much. Amazing. Thank, Thank you. you. Venite a Roma, tutti. Venite. Si. Vi aspettiamo. Al MoMA.